Hello. Hi there. Ready for a nice supper? Yeah. You drink the wine, I'll drink the I'll tasting drink. oil. <laughs> well, the wine tastes better in a glass. <laughs> the winers are here. We're making a really nice dinner tonight. It sure smells good. I hope this is my plate. Well, tell them what's on it. Garlic, shallots, right. garlic and onions. Yep, so we chopped up the, <laughs> chopped the we chopped garlic. everything up a little bit ahead of time oh, earlier today. Some garlic and shallots ready to put in a frying pan with some nice basting oil. And the basting oil is sunflower oil. It's organic and it's loaded with basters. With some herbs. Mm. Parsley, thyme and garlic. And it's really a nice way to start. And I have linguine that I have water boiling back there. I'm ready to put that in. Okay. Linguine and clams. We have little neck clams. Oh, oh my god, this is going to be so good. Little neck. Look, we have a yeah. bag of 50 clams. We're going to count them, right? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but we're going to wash them. They're nice and cold right now and they're clammed up, right? <laughs> <laughs> and we're going to open the bag and gently wash them in cold water and get them ready to put in the frying pan with seafood culinary stock. Right, now you can use uh, water, you can use vegetable broth or even chicken broth is okay, but we have culinary stock today because it keeps the flavors going here with the little neck clams. These are from the Chesapeake Bay area. Mm, that's not far, we were there. Yeah, and then we're also going to be using some butter. Did you ever do this when you were a kid? Yeah. Don't eat it like that. <laughs> it melts in my mouth. I'm going to put these in the pan, all right? Okay, you start that. I got my water boiling. I could start cleaning the clams, I guess. All right. All right. Now, when we do the handling of the clams, remember this is a raw food Shellfish. item. Shellfish. Yep, raw selfish, and we don't want to mess around Don't getting any selfish. of the raw juices mixed in with anything else we're going to eat. So we're going to go into the sink. And we're, going to, we're going to be very careful about food safety here. So we're going to cut the bag open. Open them up into the sink. And anything that has any possible clam juice on, we're going to keep right in the garbage. This is this is how we're going to look at them. Most of these are really nice and clean. We want to get all the salt water off. And a few little tips about raw clams: when you bring them home from the seafood market, you don't want to let them get immersed in melting ice or anything like that because clams will drown if they are alive and they are not used to fresh water. They're salt water animals. So if you are asking for some ice to take your clams home, keep it in a separate bag underneath the clams. Mm. Always make sure if you buy clams that are sitting in ice that they're not sitting in the water in the bottom of a basin let the water be drained away from them. Now look how nice these are. They're really in great shape. I haven't found any cracked ones or anything yet. But if you do find a cracked one, make sure you discard it right away. Don't mess around with it. No cracked clams. And I also like to make sure they're closed because that tells you that they're alive and they're keeping their lid shut. Oh, these are really beautiful. Sometimes you'll find clams with a lot of dirt on them, but this is a nice place to buy them. I bought these at Wegman Seafood Department. Maybe we can get clams and have steamed clams sometime. I like them. Yeah. So it's 50 okay. enough. Here's one cracked one. See that? Take a good close look. Cracked. We're not going to use that one. We're going to get rid of it right away. Yeah, we should do some steamed clams maybe on the grill one day. Yeah, we did that once. Throw my spaghetti over there. Okay. Seven or eight minutes for that. All right, just for fun, Rick. Let's put these all in that container. Why don't you count them? <laughs> all right. See if we got our money's worth. You just took one out already, right? Yep. Thank you. 
Plus one in the garbage. Fifty-six, right? Yeah. Okay. No water. All right. Time to eat now. I'm gonna start over here with the uh, basting oil. Uh oh. I did that. All right. We're gonna shake up the basting oil here. Shake oh, it wasn't up. that nice? I chose Ooh. the bottle with the shake it up. a lot of herbs in it. Even though it goes through shake the oil, up. I always like it's to have the bad. herbs come out on our food. So we're gonna start this up. Just tuck them together. A little basting oil in the bottom. Let me see something quick. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Pasta word. He said it, Bob. He said it. <laughs> <laughs> One word. Put the clams in. Oh, no, no, no. You keep those clams cold for a little bit. <laughs> All right. Now, as the oil starts to heat, we're going to add the garlic. Mm, that's going to smell good. And I left these in pretty big pieces. And the shallots. And you know, they're powerful little... Jean shallot. Onions. Two thumbs up. All right, I'm just going to brown these up a little bit. And after they start to brown, we're going to add the white wine and the fish stock. I'm not much of a wine guy, but... You'll enjoy I am place. a whiner. <laughs> <laughs> he is a whiner. Don't laugh at me. <laughs> That's not right. How soon till we eat? Maybe ten minutes, fifteen. About ten minutes. Yeah. You got a wine cork? A wine cork? Oh, no. Could you uncork the wine for us? You got us? a corkscrew? Oh, I thought I put it in that drawer. This. Yeah, not that. This. Oh. This. See how good I am with that. Since I'm not a professional wino. Where's the camera? Do this. Oh. Is that what you do? Or you do this? Do this. All right, now the shallots are starting to get a little bit translucent here while Rick's opening the wine. I'm going to measure two cups Ooh. of fish stock. Oh. <laughs> Let it breathe. Let it breathe. Two cups of fish stock. Fish stock. Settle down this sizzle over here. Uh-oh. Smoke alarm. I get to hear how that sounds. No, we got a new can one. Can you smell the seafood flavor in the air? Uh, I don't know. All right. No garlic and onions yet. In this pan, you can see the flavor starting to develop. A little O'Leary Chardonnay. I don't want to get bleary on O'Leary tonight. Mr. Wonderful. Thank you for your wonderful wine. Deal or no deal. <laughs> I love that one. I'm out. Okay. Looks like a meal. Okay. Now, as the spaghetti, linguine, if you please, starts to get done, we're going to be adding it to this nice broth. I believe it's done. Hmm? I believe it's done. I'm trying to hold. Give it a test. Oh, 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 Mr. Pasta Man. Hmm. <laughs> I think. Let me have a test. What about you, Mr. Pasta Lazy? <laughs> <laughs> hey, they need a single strand. I cannot spare a strand. <laughs> it is a little hot. Woo! Yeah, you're nice. Yay. Let's see. 
Is too much? We'll find out. We're going to take the spaghetti. What are you going to do now? We'll put it right in here. Okay. You're the cooker. Boy, it smells good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a better idea. I bet you're going to save a Just cup of that. Just going to save a little of the liquid in case we need a little more liquid as this cooks. All right, now we're going to spread this out. You're going to get 55 clams in there? <laughs> 55. Now you can see because we added mm. the hot ingredient here, it's already boiling quickly. Yeah. All right, now another little trick is you could take this pasta and make it earlier or use it from a leftover meal that you have. If you have spaghetti early in the week and you want to have this in a couple days, save extra spaghetti that you made or prepare extra spaghetti. Save the Just liver. Save yourself some work. Oh, All right, Rick, we're ready to the pasta. ready to get the clams in here. Now I'm going to turn this down a little bit so it's not a rolling boil. We just want to have rolling. it continuing pretty hot because we want to cook the clams quickly. All right, now they're all still closed. Mm. Are they going to fit? And they open quickly. And you'll see them open when they're ready to be eaten. We want to get them all really good and cooked. Mm. Then you wow. just dish that out onto your plate, I guess, right? Yep, and we'll serve them together with a little butter. Mm. And it looks like Good meal starting to form here. Yeah. Now we did put a lot of cold down. I'm going to turn the heat up a little bit more. I'm going to let that simmer until they all pop open. If we have a situation where one doesn't pop open in a reasonable amount of time, it goes in the garbage with the other one. Hmm. Past work. All right, let's let it simmer down. Let's set the table because I'm hungry. How's oh, yeah. that? Let's set the table. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, you can see nice tender little clams in there. As they start to open up like that, I'm going to lift them out on a plate. So we can get the spaghetti on the plate and top it with the clams and some butter. I'm ready. Feed me up. Mmm. You should see how it smells from here. I get the first plate, it looks like. Where's my plate? The heat's off. The heat is off. The heat is off. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Sure. This will have to be. Oh, picture want... time. Sorry. How's my hair? Instagram. Oh, not me. Pass the word on Instagram? Yes, it is. Pass the word show. You're on Instagram? Yeah, we're on Instagram. Me too. But it's called Pass the Word Show. Oh, yeah. Butter. Pass the Word Show. Yeah, on come and visit us there. We'll show you all the. And you'll see that picture. Come on. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that smells so good. Now get your. What butter melted okay. and what I'm going to do in the background here I'm going to check that pan to see if there's any that didn't pop open because it's important to remove them right now I'm not going to count my clams I could look at it though I would like something green like parsley or something like that how's that? you like it? Mm. 
What do you think? Oregano, parsley, a sprig of something? Hmm? any clams that didn't make it. There's one. I'll have that one. Oh. No, you won't. <laughs> Maybe it'll open in a few minutes. Yeah, it's not, it's dead to me. It's resting. To quote, it's pining. To quote our wine, O'Leary, it's dead to me. It's pining for the fuel. Oh. Resting. Salt and pepper. We're getting there. I have to show you the end result here in the pan. Now we already took two nice servings out of there, but take a look at this. <laughs> and you can see all the rest of the clams are open and it's steaming and everything, but it's perfect for even more visitors if we had company tonight or if we want to save some for later for tomorrow. Okay, that's it. My butter's melted nicely. Yeah, that's good. Did you get some greens there? No, I don't know. What would what, be good here? Parsley some. or oregano? Parsley, oregano, cilantro, thyme. Thyme is a great flavor for me lately. Okay. Oh, that's okay. What do you got? I got some fresh oregano and and some oh, just parsley. Go with the oregano. Now that should be a better picture for you. You know, you make the plate look sloppy around the edge. Oh yeah. Everybody loves that. Let's take a picture on the table. It. You put a smear on the table. <laughs> Everybody loves that. <laughs> they like it when you stage right. it. <laughs> oh man, that is so good. <laughs> I helped. The artistic. Now let's eat. Thank you. Okay. You don't want some wine? Oh no! I will oh. drink no wine before ten of nine. <laughs> First, well, let me get a piece of clam. All right. Easily. Yeah. And twirl up some spaghetti with it. Wing wing. I'm sorry. And butter. Mm. The perfect taste. Cheer me up. Oh, oh sorry. Too late. I lost my linguine. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. See, they heard about it. Talk to her. <laughs> I don't know. They heard. Hi, Dawn. We'll talk to you in a minute. Hi, Mom. Look, it's so good. All the flavors on one forkful. It's hard to keep them all in one. Did you put some parsley or oregano? No. Garlic. Garlic, parsley, and thyme is already Onions. in it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Really? Basting oil. Mmm. Remember? Mmm. Mmm. Good. Wow. I haven't had clams for a long time. Does this go good with it? Mmm. Is it a snifter? <laughs> huh? Is that why they call it that? See, I'm a wine connoisseur. I've got my snifter. Is that why they call it that? <laughs> I don't like sniffing wine. I got homemade iced tea. Mm -hmm. See? I've been drinking on it. Oh. Mmm, this is so good. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Try this at home. Mmm. How much for clams these days? $14.99 for 50. That's pretty good. Mm -hmm. If we had clams just to eat with butter, do you think 50 would be enough for one or two, a bag for each person? I think, huh? t wow, if we were just going to eat it like our supper, like crackers and butter, and we'd probably get two bags. <laughs> yeah, and small clams are the best, you know that. Well, they are tasty and mm -hmm. they're easy to eat. Mm, very nice. I hope you're all doing okay. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Please subscribe. Please make some linguine and clams. <laughs> <laughs>